What's up, hoop heads? Let's make some money on the NBA. It's Rick Kamla, aka Ricky Props, here with you with the Propapalooza heading into Friday night slate. Let's go to Minnesota. Ja Morant over 28 and a half points, minus 125. Minnesota allows the fifth most points to point guards. Jaws due for a big one, hasn't hit 30 in six straight games. The Grizz come in on a four game losing streak. This is a huge motivation spot. And Ja is at 28.2 here in the month of January. Ja, again, at the Wolves, over five and a half rebounds tonight, minus 145. Minnesota allows the fourth most rebounds to point guards. Uh, in two meetings against Minnesota this year, Ja is averaging seven and a half pulls. And Jaws matched up with D'Angelo Russell. That is a mismatch. Let's go to Miami. Tyler Hero and the Heat welcoming the Magic. I'm going over Hero. 28.5 combo of points, rebounds, and assists. Minus 120. Hero on the season is at 30.7 with the combo number. Orlando allows the third most points to shooting guards. Orlando allows the ninth most assists to shooting guards. And Hero comes off a dud nine-point performance against Boston. We got the bounce back factor in play here as well. Anthony Edwards at home against the Grizzlies tonight. Over 38.5 combo points, rebounds, and assists. Minus 115. Two meetings against Memphis this year. He's right on this number at 38.5. Here's why we're going over. Memphis allows the 11th most points to shooting guards. They allow the most rebounds to shooting guards and the 7th most assists to shooting guards. Over trends across the board. D'Angelo Russell... Uh, we're going to go under on his point prop here tonight at home against Memphis. It's 20.5. It's a minus 125. Memphis allows the third fewest points to point guards, okay? And this is a bad matchup. In two meetings against Memphis this year, D'Lo is at 9.5. Last year's playoff series, six games, D'Lo averaged 12. Go under 20 and a half. And the Ricky props rule always in play. Watch these lines throughout the day for movement. We recommend waiting until an hour before tip to place your bets based on late-breaking injury news. Time for some add one. Best bets ATS tonight. Uh, we've got only one for you. Oklahoma City, minus one at home against the Cavaliers. If Donovan Mitchell plays, all bets are off. If Mitchell sits out, which I expect, then bang on the thunder. The Cavs are in the second of a back-to-back. -back. They're a bad road team, 10 and 15 on the road. And I've got some waiver wire pickups for you today in fantasy basketball. Number one is Drew Eubanks, backup center for the Blazers. Yusuf, Yusuf Nurkic has a calf injury right now. Who knows how long he will be out. And Brandon Clark, he is the new starting center for the Memphis Grizzlies without Steven Adams. He's out three to five weeks with a knee sprain. And Dorian Finney-Smith took off last night after Luka Doncic suffered a nasty-looking ankle sprain. In the period that Luka is out, DFS will be a very good player for you. Get interactive with Ricky Props and Better Sports Network at Better Network on Twitter. What props do you like? Which ones do you agree or disagree in terms of my deliveries here? Hit us up and let us know. We're all in this together, folks. And for more NBA and college basketball betting advice and coverage, go to bettersports.com or on demand on the BSN app.